Good morning. Or actually it is, oh, it's 12.43 in the afternoon. So good afternoon. Um, everybody, this is, uh, I'm, I'm going to, I, this is actually to respond to a question from my friend Scott, who um, uh, posted a photograph on Facebook. And um, this, or a meme, if you will, I guess that would be called a meme, from God's Facebook page. As a little t cartoon figure of God, I don't, I don't think it's really God's fa Facebook page. I mean, the God. But, you know, I'll just leave that alone for right now. Anyway, by the way, I love Scott. We're, we're good friends. He's a funny guy. We're co-workers. We get along great, okay? Um, we may not agree on everything, but uh, as the saying goes, if two people agree on everything, one of them isn't necessary. In any case, uh, this particular meme has... A picture of Jesus kind of um, leaning into the picture and saying words to the effect of I'm not reading it so forgive me Scott <clears throat> saying uh, you know I was going to come back but when I found that all of my followers that didn't use the word all but that's sort of understood when it says I found that my followers hated people of with brown skin, who couldn't speak English, who were immigrated from other countries, basically Muslim. I changed my mind. You know, I just figured that they would want to crucify me again, so I changed my mind. And I said, that is just simply false. I re okay, first of all, I realize it's a joke, okay? So you're trying to convey some sort of a truth on the heels, you know, and kind of wrap it around some humor so it's a little easier to take. Or, but I, honestly, so I, actually I'm just going to take away the humorous part of it first. I'm just going to destroy the whole thing. Okay, first of all, it's just not true. First of all, he is coming back. If you're a believer, he is coming back. Okay, well, he's coming back even if you're not a believer. But you may not believe that if you're not a believer. As a Christian, yes, he's coming back. And it's not because, well, he's just coming back. Okay, I can guarantee you if he wasn't coming back, it wouldn't be because he was afraid of being crucified again. But that's sort of beside the point. Let me get to the main gist of this and the message that this meme is trying to send which is absolutely false okay um that somehow christians hate people with brown skin first of all all i have to do <clears throat> is take a, a a bus up into um our uh the city of portland which i don't live in but i live close to and go into any number of black churches and find out that that's not true. We have, and you know what? People like me, I don't, I don't hate people of any, of any skin color, okay? And that's pretty much true, I mean, just in our area. But here's a fact. This is from the pewforum.org. And so, this is for anyone who sees this sort of uh, little thing thrown out there. There are basically about 2.7 billion Christians in the world, worldwide. And just so you know, that's far and away above the Muslim population worldwide. It makes up about one-third of the world's population. So we're still a minority, okay? But it's a large number. 
Muslim population about 25 percent, but that's that's another discussion. <clears throat> Professing Christians in America is about. I'm going to round it up to about 2.5. There's 250 million people. So that's about. I guess that's about what one tenth of one percent, or one one hundredth of one. Anyway, of the total number of Christians worldwide, so to make such a blanket statement says you are unbelievably misinformed. But here's another thing, is that that 2.7 billion people is geographically distributed over 200 countries worldwide. It includes... African countries. You know, Indonesia, which is mostly a Muslim country, still has a Christian population that is more than all of the 20 countries in the Middle East combined. So, there's plenty of representation. Christians don't hate people of color. I'm not saying that racism and bigotry has never or does not now exist in some Christian churches, maybe in pockets geographically, but to make a blanket statement like that is patently false. And Scott, you need to teach me how to dance. Have a great day.